How's everybody doing? Welcome. Uh, my name is Funky D Riggs, and welcome back to Let's Play of The Walking Dead Season 1. Anyway, so we left off here where we gotta uh, search the perimeter so we can make sure that it's safe for the little kitties and the rest of our group to come in here. Because, uh, yeah, we did find out, we did leave off on a farm. And, um, so yeah, there is a swing ground look at here, so we're gonna check this out. But, uh, yeah, I do wanna say thank you guys for your support on this series so far. And on the channel, if you guys want more, just go ahead and uh, keep on the positive feedback and support. And too bad it's yeah. broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. Um, uh, mind if I try to fix it? I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks like it just All needs right. a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck, and let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Alright, so I guess that's one thing we gotta look at then. Alright, so some boards and stuff, I don't really know where you can find these boards at. But, um, yeah, so far my opinion on this game is literally, this game is amazing, dude. Like, did they, did, tell me, did you turn off the freaking generator? Oh, no, but I'll talk to you real quick. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Um, we can help yeah, protect the dairy. Extra people to protect the dairy. You can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that. But thanks. Um, so let's go Mark fix the perimeter. Help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. So, what are we looking for here? Are we just looking for, like, meat? And uh oh, oh snap! Oh, so it's automatically doing it for us. Okay. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. He wouldn't be such a pain in the ass if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. I, I'm, I'm sorry. All right. I mean, I'll, I try to be civil at least, so we'll work it out somehow. We'll work it out somehow. Well, hopefully he'll calm down once he's out here. <laughs> that little crow's eating that boy. Is he even dead? How do you? How do you know for sure Lee, if he's even de dead? Yeah, he's dead. Come on, let's push it off. All right, so let's go ahead and take the arrow out real quick. Disgusting. All right, so and zombie. Come on, <laughs> I'm sure there's still a few more. He looks dead. Once looks this dead, place is up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Um, a fortress needs people to defend it. It's useless without gas. Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas. Easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. Uh, we can take this place if you want to. Um... We've got enough people to take this place by force if we have to. Sheesh, Lee. You sound like Kenny. There's another I'm one. sorry. I see it. I just want to take something by force, you know, just, just conquer. Uh, let me look at the zombie real quick and see if he's actually dead. I don't think he's really dead or anything. Hold on. Is he dead? He looks dead. Eight. Yeah, he, he looks dead. Uh, Might want to chop off his own. Yeah, there we go. Uh, just, yeah. Yee. Okay, chop off the other one. Yee. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Do we also gotta cut off the? Oh, okay. I guess Christ. that'll just stay right there. Can't stop thinking about dinner. 
Would have been nice to get some of those rations. I get hungry too, you know. Um, we'll go ask for more we'll to eat. Ask for after. more to eat after this is done. All right, I can suck it up. <laughs> That's not what I. Oh, I think snap. I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other oh boy, side. Mr. Crispy. Good idea. <clears throat> Whoa. Boy, got hops. Uh, let me go ahead and pick this one up. Oh, snap. Okay, here we go. Tap, 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 any tap, 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 any tap, tap. Holy fuck. What just happened? Fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Oh, snap. What the heck? What the? Get to the gate. Get down. You asshole. Jesus. What are you doing? We had to bring it. Now you're fucked. Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With the fence on, that gate is our only way out. Today, rat. We had what the to heck are we... Oh my god, dude. I don't know. Yo, let's just push this thing real quick. What are you talking about? I didn't even do anything. Um. Can, can I get out the open, please? Thank you very much. Okay, go, go, go. Alright, dude. I don't know what the freak I need to do here. Oh, oh, hold on. I see, I see what I need to do here. Hurry up. The blades are stuck in the dirt. We had the the blades are stuck in the dirt. Okay. So I see what we got to do here. Uh, we got to get the stuff out the dirt, and I guess we got to just you use this up right quick. Oh, my God. All right. Is it still stuck? Shit, something's still blocking. Still stuck. Oh, dude, what? We're what blocking it? Is, uh, I think there's something on the front, is there? Oh, snap, is this thing right here? Okay. Come on. We can reach the gate. We can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! Shit, that Get the tractor. Oh, get to the gate using the tractor as cover. Dude, this is bad, dude. Dude, why are why are they shooting at us, bro? What happened? Shit, it's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move. All right, gonna have to move this thing. Well, you don't say. Of course, we're behind the tractor. Oh my god, dude, this is crazy, bro. Like. You know how intense this is? Oh, there's another zombie, dude. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? We push a lot. Uh, yeah, let me just go ahead and move this out the way if you don't mind me doing. No, no, no. Oh my god, dude! Get off of me! Get off of me! Get. Oh my god, dude. Oh! I did that. You okay? Yeah. Barely. Come on. Barely. Dude. He literally threw the freaking dude. Oh my god, dude. He is literally on my cheeks right now. Thank you. Let's get out of here. Dude, he was literally on my Oh my god. What were they doing out there trying to kill us anyway? Lee, what's wrong? Um, it was a goddamn ambush out there. Holy shit, are, are you okay? Bandits here on our property? Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those I have a feeling that you did it. Mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out. 
Hey, yo. Well, can we get him somewhere Ma safe? Oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. Well, so much for your understanding. It isn't safe as we thought. Maybe it isn't as safe here as we thought. Look, we're sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these yeah! camps are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready, Wait, we're to actually gonna go to their camps? Camp, come find us. Dude, that's gonna be fun Andy, for this video. Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Shut Dad up. Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Wait, she volunteered, or do you mean you just set her up for failure? I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. Oh, kids wow. Kids like swings. A swing? I love swings. Just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Must be nice to have some fun. We're looking out for you. Well, uh, I guess we're just going to go talk to um, that other people. I mean, I guess there's nothing else here. Dude, I, I want to just go over here and get kicked in the head, dude. Can I get kicked? Oh, I got kicked. Ah! What the heck? Okay, anyway. So, yeah, we're just going to go talk to... um. Who are, who are the people? I don't know. Let's go talk. Let's go take over the bandit camp, fellas. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Yeah. yeah let's go! Be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Oh, Clementine is... Clementine. Oh, wait, I got a gun, too? Oh, man, it's gonna be fun. I got a gun. See anything? Not yet. I know it's around here. It's gotta be close. Um, you found it? Yeah. This is intense, dude. The music is making it even fun. Or much better. Sneak up to the camp. Alright. Seems easy enough. 
I'm gonna have some freaking jump scare come up, dude. I'm gonna be all crying and stuff. I'm gonna you be like, ah! No, I mean, hold on. Stay on your guard. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tan. I think it's innocent people or something. I think there's, I think Carly and Carly and uh, the other people are in there. I don't know. It's empty. Clear. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. So, what do you expect me to, like, <laughs> hold on. Crate? Nothing. Alrighty, I guess boxes? Empty. Are you kidding me? Empty. Uh, they got food here. Oh, we got look at the lawn chair. Let's see what this looks like. They expected to be here a while. More figures. Okay, so he's examining the tent. So I guess we're okay. Save lots of box. I mean, the they said that this is a the, the, the I can't even talk. The They're all from save lots. The first few days, they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Um. This is too much stuff for just one person. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. Alright, so let's see what else is around here, Chief. Got another, got another save lots box. Oh, St. John Dairy. Okay, we gotta check that out too. This is from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Huh? Well, wait. There's a what camera. A video a camera. camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see Good. if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily? I thought you were running things back there. Yeah, but uh, uh she's got the combat training. <laughs> oh my, what? <laughs> dude, what are you talking about? Dude, we, I do have it under control. I'm Lee. Just water. Which is pretty good. I mean, we could use all freaking water. All right, let's see. What else do we have around here? We got trash. Yuck. Some of my I'm tripod is. Some of my tripod is uh, blocking the way, so I can't. I can barely see. All right. So, is there anything else we need around here? Like, oh, hold on. Wait. I saw a gas can earlier. Hold on. Gas can. Nothing but fumes. Shit. What are we? What are we looking for? Ooh, hold on, wait. Shopping mm. cart. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Okay, so let's go examine this tent then. So, oh snap. The bloody bunny? Oh god. Oh man. That's what I'm saying. Alright, uh sleeping bag. The hell? Don't you fucking move. Shit! Put your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my what is shit. She? Steal everything from me. Why are you alone up here? What happened to you? 
Well, that's a hell of a question, mister. They told me I'd be safe with them. Men who lived here. But it weren't safe. Not for me. And not for my girl. They didn't treat her nice. Not at all. They took her away into the woods. Wouldn't tell me where. And I begged them every way I could think. They just laughed. <laughs> so I killed them. And I'm staying here till she comes back to me. One way okay, crazy lady. Um, you may want to put that uh, crossbow back. down. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. That's Where did you get Clementine's hat? Where did you get this Are hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Put down, Put down a crossbow. crossbow. No, sir, I need it. I need it to kill you fuckers. <laughs> Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind. Oh. Yeah, I told not to shoot her, but, uh, you know. How may I assist you? With a bullet to the brain, that's good enough for me. God damn it. I was five seconds away from shooting her myself. Well, maybe you should have. Maybe I didn't. But yo, that what was they talking it's about? I didn't shot though, right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. <laughs> what a waste. So that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are, and it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Um. Can I take that crossbow? Come on. Can I have that crossbow and you can have this rifle so you can like, oh bro, you can dual wheel snipers, bro. You can be like, <laughs> boo 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 boo. But do we still have the hat though for Clementine? That was pretty freaking intense, though. I'm not gonna lie, though. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. <laughs> what? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. Um. <sighs> well, you see, what happened was like we had a bunch of people come after us. This Not a bunch, like Terry one person. Would have wanted. Terry. My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody, then. Why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What's going what on with them? Don't know. Squabbling, looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Yeah, I mean, don't mind them. It's just how they are. They, they can't agree. about how we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. No, it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry and people get a little stir crazy when their tummy's empty. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. I kind of want to go check out the little moo cow, man. I kind of want to... Yeah, I'm about to go check on the little cow. Hi, Clementine. Oh, I got your hat, by the way. Oh. Yeah, just pull that hat right out of my butt and call it a freaking butt hat. All right. Let's go, um, let's go to them, them, them boys and girls and girls. Let's go to Katja, Clementine, and Ducky.
All right, so there goes Leroy over there. I mean, my bad. <laughs> Not Leroy. Uh, what's his name? I forgot his name. Jeez, he got scared over that, dude. Really? All right, Ayo Clementine, uh, when this game loads up. Ayo Clementine, oh, hey. It's a little moo cow, man. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. But it's not your cow, though, so you can't tell me to pet someone else's cow. Oh. Moo cow. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you licked it. I, it's okay. Um, Moo Cow. Oh, yeah, Clementine, your hat. Hey, Clementine. My hat! You found it! Yeah, some old you hag bag. It? You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? Um, I haven't thought about it in a while. I mean, I'll do someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Well, thanks for finding my hat. Wait, no, welcome, no. Sam. I shouldn't do you be. Want wait, no. With me? Nah, but you go on ahead. I kind of, I kind of want to pet the little moo cow, man. Hey, All right, Aaron. so let's go talk to Andy. Yeah. Um. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Uh, when do you think we might eat? Think uh, we might eat. Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. How's the cow? Well, How's the moo cow? Now we got That's what I wanted to ask. <laughs> Doctor, Doctor Katja. All right, so let's go ahead and get out of here. Oh wait, open the wait. Open up these little doors, man. It's just that, really. It's, it's really. It's just that. Wait, did I just hear that cow moo? Moo. I know I heard something moo. It's, it's another freaking salt lick. They lick that drink and they'd be like. All right, so let's get out of here and uh, let's go see if the food's going to be ready. I don't know if we got to do anything just for the food to be ready. All right. Excuse me, I would like to get out of here. Bye, everybody. Have a wonderful time petting the moo cow, man. <laughs> so, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. <laughs> That's the boy. <laughs> That's the boy right there. What is that? Hey, hey, oh, hey, pile. Like I said, part of my tripod is blocking the way, so I can barely even see what the freaking heck they're talking about. Uh, so we got the gasoline there. That's crazy. Um, dude, you're supposed to be freaking cooking, not talking up other boys, dude. Hey, man. We'll uh, we'll finish talking later. Hey, man. You been getting along with Larry? <laughs> He's just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? Uh, don't know if I would have used those words exactly. Don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity every now and then. No, I'm, no, like, I'm not talking about sweetheart, dude. We ran into... How's Mark doing in there? Best what? patient I ever had. I guess we gotta My just ask questions so around until something happens. Hollering. He could definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. Are you sure? Uh, Why not are you to all... be rude, ma'am. How come you're out here 
Instead of, you know. <laughs> oh, you want to know why I'm not slaving away in the kitchen? Is that it? Uh, yeah. No, no, I didn't mean for it to sound like that. Oh, it's okay, darling. Got it slow cooking in the oven. Should be ready before too long. Okay, uh, we ran into some trouble out there then. I don't trust this girl. Hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. Uh, I'm. We met a woman at the camp. Died, we met a woman out there at her camp. She wasn't one of those bandits. Sounded like they did something pretty bad to her. And your marauders are still out there. I think all them folks out in the woods had drug problems. What does that have to do with anything? Means you can't trust them. Any of them. I think I'll go have a look around. Kind of peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters frying against the fence before too long. I mean, I like the sound of monsters frying. Like, you know, the freaking Wonder Waffle dude. That's the, that's the most hottest sound, dude. Like, the freaking... You know what I'm saying? That freaking... Alright, so how are we going to get over there to the... To, oh, snap, Lily. Or Larry. I don't know. All right, so we're gonna talk to these two last people, and um, if the food ain't done, then well, I guess we'll just end the video right here, and we'll eat next video <laughs> if we can't eat. Hey, Larry, what's up? I do want to apologize, Larry. If you if you're still up for you know, taking my apology into hand. So, Larry, it uh, looks like you're getting along with Brenda pretty well. You know, for a nice change of pace, how about you try and mind in your own fucking business? I just. Okay. Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? No, I didn't. They ain't shot someone. We found a tent. We found Nothing a tent happened. We found a... Nothing really useful. Seriously? No food? Jesus. Um... What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here and we don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. I mean... Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. So... Does he treat you like that, too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes. I know that. But he's not... More than an guy. ass, but, you know, I'm not going to... I'm, I'm not going to He's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much. And lost... Pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. I'm not gonna judge you for that. I mean, dude, like... Do you get the feeling that something's going on in here? Something's going on here. What makes you say that? What exactly happened at the camp? Uh, it's nothing. Uh, don't worry about it. Paranoia just getting to me a little bit. I know what you mean. These backwoods people always give me the creeps. If you ask me, we should just get our dinner and leave. That's Come what we're probably. No. We don't want to be rude. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I never asked you, but okay. I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. Okay, well, I never asked you anyway, but okay. Uh, so let's go ahead and... Ooh, man, look at my shoes. Oh, them things clean. All right, uh, so let's go ahead and uh, check out the stuff because um, I am using a PS4 capture, so I got about 30 more minutes left. I'm I, I'm hoping. If not, then well, <laughs> I, I I do apologize if it if the video goes off randomly. But um, 
Yeah, so let's go ahead and check out this place. Wait, actually, matter of fact, let's go talk to him. Let's go talk Hello. to my boy Dan Dan. Glad I got to use her today. My girl. What do you mean? Um, you run this place with just one moo cow? Just one cow. Used to have more. They get hungry too, or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. <laughs> you really, you really like that gun. gun. What's not to like? Why do you sound like Just that? Just creepy, that's all. Times like these, a 243 will keep you warmer at night than any lady I ever know. <laughs> Danny noticed your suspicion. You pretty I'm sorry. Here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Dude, you are sounding a little bit too weird about this, dude. Alright, um... Is there anything else behind here that I... Dude, I can't... I can't talk to any, anybody else? Hello. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Dude, he is so freaking weird, dude. It'll be a good one. Like, oh my god, dude, like... What, what do I gotta go to wait, to wait for supper? What's on your mind, Lee? When will dinner be ready? Should be ready before too long. Dude, where the freak am I supposed to go? I mean, shoot. I mean, I don't mind playing this game a little bit longer than I have to, though, but if I could actually... It would have been better if, 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 yeah, you know. Oh, wait a minute. Toolbox. Probably make two swings, so, like, I could push Clementine and Kenny can push Duck, and we can all be fair. Alright. Multi-tool? I'm just gonna borrow this for a second. Uh, why borrow that? Well, I bet they go through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. So we got a multi-tool, but for what though? I don't, I don't know exactly. All right. So I mean, we still need to talk to other people. Like, I guess we, I guess the main objective is just like talk to like everybody in the world. Is there anybody else around here? Like around this corner? No. And like literally, dude, Mark, they're hi They're not letting me go in a building. Like, they think I'm gonna find something. I mean, I don't even know what I if, I, if I'm gonna find anything or not, though. All right, guys, you still petting the freaking moo cow? Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Thanks. Yep. <laughs> How do you like that cow, Clint? She's pretty. What? Have I missed anything? No, not really. Hmm, <laughs> it smells funny in here. Like manure. What's manure? Duty. <laughs> Kids. <laughs> Childish, bro. Alright, can I speak to freaking cot job, bro? I can't talk to them. Alright, yo, what's this over here? I ain't, dude, I ain't see this part. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? Um. I'll protect, I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is, we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal on those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. We're dealing with a bunch of freaking bull. Oh my god, screw. I need a screwdriver. Uh, I'm not gonna take the lock apart. Hey, Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? No, 
Why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban? Oh, <laughs> you are not saying what I think you're saying. <laughs> Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. You freaking racist, dude. <laughs> oh, because, you know, you're black. Oh, stop. Yeah, I'm sorry, guy. Hmm. Okay. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. And the mo cow. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? Yeah. Um, uh, Kenny thought he heard a noise. He's a little jumpy, huh? Well, we're all sure glad his wife is here. She's a lifesaver. You, you got no idea. Hey, uh, did she touch favor. you? Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. So, I guess that's one thing we gotta do then. Alright, um... Hey guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on. Enough Shut up. Already. Hey guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on. Enough already. Alright, so I guess we gotta distract Andy with something. Alright. Um. So yeah, I guess I'm in a video right here because there's really just 20 minutes left till, you know, this thing shuts off itself. But uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, you know what to do. Like, share, subscribe, comment. My name is Funky D. Regs and uh... I'll see you guys with some Doki Doki video tomorrow because, you know, I know you guys like Doki Doki. But anyway, thank you guys for all your support and as always, I'll see you guys in the next video.